Hey guys, Big Phil here, and I love smartwatches because smartwatches are very useful and very helpful. And I've done so many videos about different smartwatches from different companies. So, in today's video, we're going to check out a budget smartwatch from the company Doji. This is the Doji CR1 Pro. It is their first smartwatch with GPS. Yeah, a GPS on a budget smartwatch. That's incredible. So in this video, we're going to find out everything about this smartwatch so that you guys should decide if this is a smartwatch for you. And for the price of about 65 US dollars, you really want to stay tuned to the end to find out everything about this watch. And please, if you're new to this channel, hit the subscribe button and turn on notification for a lot of good videos. Come up on Big Phil TV. <music> There are three main things that caught my attention about this smartwatch. Number one is the price. For the price of 65 US dollars, it is good. And the watch is really good. Y'all are going to find out in this video. Secondly, GPS. This watch has a GPS, a budget smartwatch with GPS. That is great. I've done a lot of reviews about different budget smartwatches on this channel, and none of them had GPS. This is the first budget smartwatch I'm reviewing on Big Phil TV with GPS, which is great. And the third thing, this smartwatch, even though it's a budget smartwatch, it has a lot of flagship features. This watch has a whole day heart rate tracking, blood oxygen feature, 14 workout mode, battery life, seven days battery life on a typical usage, sleep monitoring, and a whole lot of other great features that we're gonna find out in this video. The packaging is very small and very simple which is nothing to complain about. The first thing we can see is the watch. And man, it looks nice, small. This color is gray-black. They call it gray-black because the, the watch actually is gray. Then the stripes is black. Now let's put it on the side and see what's, what else comes in the box. I think right here is the charging cable. Yeah, this is the charging cable right here. And a quick start guide. This is the watch, guys. The Doji CR1 Pro. Beautiful, man. I like it. I like the build quality. It just feels good. It's light. It weighs around 46 gram, which is great. Not heavy, not light. Just a nice weight on it. According to the company, the watch right here, uh, the bezel of the watch is built with a glossy ceramic material, which I think is great. A glossy ceramic. The watch straps, silicone. Very nice, feels good. On one corner, we have two buttons. I think this one on the top, which has a little red accent, is to power on the device. There's a little red accent, which looks good. And the second button on the bottom, I don't know, I'm going to find out what's the use of this button right here. The watch has no speakers, I think no microphones too. Yeah, there's no microphone, no speaker. So I don't think you can make calls with the watch, but you can receive notifications and everything. Overall, the watch is 45 millimeter which is nice size, but it, the screen size is 1.28 inches. Yeah, 1.28 inches. The watch strap has a release, a universal release mechanism. Just pull it like this, and the watch band is 22 millimeter, which is great because I have a lot of 22 millimeter watch strap right here. It's a white one. It looks great on it. Yeah. Then on the back, we have all the sensors. Uh, the heart rate, the blood oxygen, the sleep tracking, everything is right here. And the charging part, it's, make, uh, it's magnetized. It's not wireless charging, so you have to drop it. It magnetized right here, and it starts charging. Just like this. Oh, nice. This is nice, man. Man, I like this watch. The build quality is great. For 65 US dollars, the build quality is incredible. It has almost the same build as my Galaxy watch, for my Galaxy watch right here. As you can see very slim man, slimmer than my galaxy watch you see that and also much slimmer than my huawei smartwatch <laughs> oh this thing is slim so if you're somebody who likes slimmer watches or watches that are much lighter this is something you should check out the build quality is great man i love it i really like this watch the build quality is nice i've done a lot of video of uh, budget smartwatches but this right here is the best this feels and looks premium like if you put on this watch right here, people are gonna think you bought it for like for like a thousand for like three hundred US dollars. 
because the build quality, it looks great, it feels great. But let's see, let's power it on and find out everything about this watch. To pair up this smartwatch to your device, you have to download the VeriFit app or you can simply just scan right here. You scan the QR code, which I'm going to do right now with my Galaxy. And the app is available for Android and iOS, which is great. So once you scan it, it takes you to the website. From here, it goes to the app. That's it. Install it. I want you guys to see all the different steps of pairing so you know if it's easy or difficult to pair up this device, this smartwatch to your phone. Now, the app is already installed, so what I'm going to do is click on Open. Then right here, it takes me directly to the app. Start to use. Agree. All right. Why using the app? That's it right there. Doji CR1 Pro GPS. As you can see, it's pairing already. Uh-huh. Click right here. And that's it. It's finished. Oh, wow. It's fast. The repairing process of this watch is very easy, like very simple. And now we're in. This is what the watch looks like. This is the main watch face. If you want to access other watch faces, you press and hold. Then you swipe from left to right or right to left. It takes you to all the different watch faces. Right now, there are three watch faces pre-installed. We've got one, two, and three. I like this one right here. I'm going to use this one. Then, if you press this button on the top, it takes you to all the different features. We've got things like health data, exercise, exercise record, heart rate, sleep, blood oxygen, stress, uh, breath training, stopwatch, timer, al alarm, music. Oh, that's nice. It's got music. Weather, find my phone, and settings. Let's get in the settings. In the settings, you got tire screen on time, dimming, which right now is on the maximum brightness. Let me put on two. If you want to go back, you swipe from either from left to right. So like this to go back. Then I've got watch faces, reset, restart, power off, and about. About the watch, let's see. Yeah, it's running. The Doji version 2. Right now. If you press this button on the bottom, it takes you to all the different exercises. Remember, I told you guys that this watch has 14 different exercises. We've got outdoor running, indoor running, outdoor work, indoor work, hiking, outdoor cycling, cricket, yoga, indoor cycling, workout, which is one I like to use most, pool swimming, open water swim, rower, uh, rower, and elliptical. So those are the 14 exercises you can track with this watch right here. I'm really impressed at the resolution of this watch. It has a resolution of 240 by 240, which is very sharp. I mean, it's really good. But I'm not going to say it's as good as that of my Huawei watch or my Galaxy watch. But the resolution on this watch for the price of 65 US dollars is a budget smartwatch. But the resolution is very good, very sharp, man. Look at the, look at the watch face. It's really good. When you swipe from left to right, it takes you to the basic features like stress, a heart rate, step count, and yeah, three. Three basic features, which is good. It's good to have it here. I wish there was also a blood oxygen here, but it got just stress, uh, heart rate, and step. Yeah, and when you swipe from top to bottom, it takes you to all the notifications. Like right now, I got an SMS. I can type on it to read it, and I can also delete it right here. Then when you swipe from bottom to top, it takes you to the quick settings, like do not disturb, like find my phone, find my phone is there. That's nice. It also takes you to the brightness. One, two, three brightness. And it takes you, or you can also access the settings from there. Oh, that's nice. So that's everything about this watch. Now let's check out the app. Now the app, you got... The watch is there, the connected watch gives you the battery percentage. Then the watch faces, when you click right there, it takes you to more watch faces. Oh, nice, new arrivals. From here, you can download more watch faces. Oh, that's cool. There are a lot of other watch faces that you can download from here. Like, check it out. And they're all free, which is great. I mean, I've done review of many other budget smartwatches, but none of them had this amount of watch faces. I'm so impressed, man.
And check out this one, guys. This watch face is cool. <laughs> But I don't think this watch has an always on display. There is no always on display on the watch, which I, I mean, I, I, I cannot complain. It's a budget watch. When you type on the bottom, you have exercise. It takes you to home. You can have all your different exercise data right here on the app. So even the app also is good, has a lot of features. You can do so much from the app. I, the, what I love the most are the watch faces. A lot of beautiful watch faces, and they're all free. So this is the one I'm going to be using. I love this one. Beautiful. I'm so impressed at this watch. The features are just so good. And that's the reason why I said it is a budget watch, but has a lot of flagship features. Oh, man, it's really cool, man. I like this. Even the battery life on this thing is great. According to the company, you can have seven days on a typical usage and five hours with uh, GPS, which is true. I mean, if you're using GPS on a watch, it drains down the battery so fast. Any smartwatch, once you turn on your GPS, the battery runs down really fast. So on this watch, five hours with GPS. Yeah. And that's everything about the Do GCR1 Pro. It is a great smartwatch. Do I like it? Yes, I love it. And why do I like it? Number one, the build quality. It's very good. I'm so impressed at the build quality on this watch, man, guys. Trust me. The build quality is really good. And the price, 65 US dollars. Very good. The design, so nice design. Like, check it out. I like the design of the watch. It looks cool. It looks classy. And... Uh, 5 ATM water resistant. Yes, it has 5 ATM, which means you can go diving with it. You can go swimming with this watch and without any issue. The features, a lot of great health features on this watch. Blood oxygen features that you find mostly on flagship smartwatches are on this watch right here. The display is just so good at 240 by 240. The resolution is so sharp, so good. The battery life, incredible. The battery life, according to the company, seven days on typical usage. 49 days on standby time and five hours when you're using the GPS. And lastly, the strap. The strap that comes with it is so good. It's soft, comfortable, feels good on the wrist. Yeah. So it is a watch that I can recommend to anybody, especially somebody looking for a great budget smartwatch. This is it right here, guys. Check it out. The Doji CR1 Pro. The link in the description below. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you're new to this channel, please hit the subscribe button and turn on notification for a lot of good videos come up on Big Phil TV. Until then, see you into the next one. Peace.